What are you guys doing? Look at this order for him. It's for popcorn. Popcorn? What kind? Popcornopolis. It's so good. Really? Why? All the flavors, duh. Yes, mine is caramel. Mine is also caramel. <laughs> that sounds so good. Yeah, Madison and Ariana are giving off free samples. Go try some. Okay, okay. bye, peace. Where are they? Where are they? Oh, my God. Let me show you how it's really done. So there are five popcorn. There's zebra popcorn, caramel corn, kettle corn, jalapeno cheddar, and white cheddar. They're all in regular size except for the zebra popcorn. There's a regular and there's a jumbo one. You can also buy the five cone gift basket, the ten cone gift basket. And on the back. There's this order form. You put the customer's names here. You put the phone number here. Say if there, if a person wanted to order two jalapeno cheddar, you would put number two right there. And you round up the total right here. And also, in these little tiny boxes, you only check mark it if only if they paid. And we don't not ch accept checks. And up here you put your teacher's name, you put your school name, which for us is Norseman, you put your student's name and your teacher's name, and then you put your order and money due date, then you put the delivery date, and you put the check pay payable. Thank you. Now I feel good and I can start selling it now. So Mrs. Sanders, a student is going to do all this work and sell so much popcorn, but what will they get? A, a Christmas party at Mrs. Collins' house. <laughs> Wouldn't that be fun? But I think fifth grade's already hooked up the winner. Oh cool, what does the winner get? Uh, the top selling class gets a pizza party. At Mrs. Collins' house? We're not going to Mrs. Collins' house, Tracy. Oh. Oh, it's okay, Tracy. But we do have tickets that they can earn, and for every five popcorns that they sell, they'll earn one ticket. So the more you sell, the more chances you have to win, and the prizes are you can get movie passes, you can also get a mystery box item, and there's also a bike. Wow. What? I'm going to get a new bike? I'm sorry, Mrs. St. Louis. You're not selling the popcorn, but you can buy popcorn from one of your students. I'm totally visualizing myself on that bike. Odyssey Nason here, and thanks for tuning in. As fun as selling popcorn is, we want to make sure you understand there's a wrong and right way while making these so. You're right, Odyssey. You can't just ask anybody. So to help you guys out, we want to share the do's and don'ts as you guys do your part in raising money for our school. Do ask friends and family for help. Don't ask strangers you've never met. Do sell with a family member. Don't sell alone. Do let parents sell at their work. Don't knock on doors. Do collect cash payments as soon as possible. Don't accept IOUs or checks. Do ask for a full name and a phone number. Remember, you are responsible for selling, collecting, and delivery of the popcorn customers buy from you. Exactly! Be aware of your surroundings and ask your teacher if you don't understand certain things. 
So get motivated and get out there, Vikings, to show your Norsemen pride and make us proud. Any last words, fifth grade teachers? Thanks, Jason and Odyssey. Oh, hey, Norsemen Vikings. Fifth grade would like to thank you all again for your help with selling popcorn. Yes, remember, the more popcorn we sell, the more we can help our school. Tell them exactly how the money will help us. Oh, definitely. The profit that we make is going to go towards some great stuff, especially for teachers and classes. Supplies and even brand new awesome books, for sure. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Also, that money can help us for fun school events, sports, and even fun field trips. And don't forget what Odyssey and Asen taught you about the safety, do's and don'ts of selling. You're going to need them when you're going out there and trying your best. Don't forget to buy yourselves and us mm -hmm. some delicious popcorn for the holidays. Mm -hmm. Right, Mrs. Vane? Right, Mrs. Vane. Mm -hmm. Thanks, guys.